Hello everybody, welcome to part two of the blending mode tutorial in Photoshop CS6. Now, what we're going to do in this uh, part of the tutorial is uh, go through the uh, lighten group of our blending modes, which is uh, the lighten, screen, color dodge, linear dodge, and lighter color. And I'll tell you about each one of the um, blending modes, and if we have time, I'll uh, get another set of uh, tutorial or another set of blending modes and I'll do that in this tutorial also. So the light in blending mode which is the first one here is pretty much the opposite of the darken blending mode. So what's going to happen is that the really dark dark stuff is not going to show up in the top layer but the really bright stuff is. So if I turn off the top layer real, or if I turn off the bottom layer real quick and uh, change the blending mode real quick back to normal. We remember that the left side of the uh, gradient is black and we're gonna suspect that the black is going to just disappear when I put it on lighten and that the white, the pure white here is going to shine right through. And then the really bright parts of the green and really bright parts of the yellow that are brighter than the picture below it are also gonna come through. So let me put this back on lighten, and uh, what? I, and then you can see that that is true. So we've got the black part of the gradient is completely gone, and the white part is showing. And uh, this is going to be constant throughout the lighten group. So in uh, the lighten blending mode, the um, the layers, the pixels of the layer replaced with um, the lighter <clears throat> whichever is lighter so as I said before pretty much the brightest brights which is the brightest white is always going to show through when you have lighting on now let's come over to the next blending mode which is screen and here it is now screen is like lighten but it's brighter and it removes more of the dark pixels. <clears throat> Something about screen is that it also has some smoother transitions between the colors. So it kind of works like the uh, multiply blending mode, which I talked about in the previous tutorial, in the fact that it multiplies the light pixels together to create, to bring out like the most light pixels in the uh, with the two uh, layers combined so hopefully hopefully that made sense the next one we're gonna go to is color dodge now color dodge is brighter than the uh, screen blending mode and it's a contrasty color and it results in like saturated midtones and uh, blown out highlights so that's what the color dodge is for. Now let's go to linear dodge add. Now linear dodge add is um, pretty sweet sometimes. It's brighter than color dodge, but less saturated and intense. So this also kind of gives me this vintage kind of look. If you use the right colors, if you don't like use white in it, but you use the colors, it kind of gives out like a washed out kind of look that uh, is kind of classic in some of those washed out vintage pictures. The next one that we're going to go over is the last part and that is called lighter color. Lighter color um, lightens the composite channel instead of the separate red, green, and blue channels. So if you find out a use for that, this one's kind of funny though. It looks like he's got a mask on and a booger in his nose and one booger in his mouth. It's kind of weird, but <laughs> I don't know. That's funny looking, but that's a um, lighter color for us. So that's it for the light and blending modes. And we're pretty much at five minutes already. So I'll just uh, end this tutorial and then we can go on to the next set of um, blending modes down here in the next tutorial. So thanks for watching this one and subscribe if you want to see more tutorials um, in Photoshop. It helps us out a lot. Thanks a lot. Have a good one.